today I am going to be filming for you my hair routine as well as my skincare routine. And I was reading through my comments the other day thinking of a new video to film for you guys. And I saw a ton of requests for both of these things. But I was hesitant to do it because I knew each video would be really, really short because both my hair care routine and my skincare is really, really simple. So I decided I would just smush the two together into one video, and that's what I'm doing today. Also, can we just talk about how cute this gets be? Oh, he's so cute. Are you ready to talk about your skin and hair care? Do you have some fur care tips for us? Are you gonna help me? Or are you gonna sleep? He's gonna sleep. The first thing we'll start with is hair. We'll just start with hair. And I'll just start by saying kind of the background of my hair. I have naturally straight hair and the last time I dyed my hair was about three years ago and I got highlights and so my hair was really, really blonde. But now I feel like most of it's just my natural color and maybe some there's some light, lighter parts at the end from my old highlights. So that is my hair. Oh, my hair gets oily very quickly and that's pretty much the background of my hair. So really the only thing I use on my hair is my shampoo and conditioner and I use this and it's Pantene Smoothing Shampoo and Pantene Smoothing Conditioner. And how I know to get this at the store is because it has an avocado on the front. And so I'm like, oh, my shampoo, the avocado one. So these are the two that I use. And by the way, they're like $3. They're super, super cheap and um, I love that. And also they smell so good. And so I use those two shampoo and conditioners. Since I said my hair gets oily really fast, I feel like they make my hair stay really clean for a longer time so I don't have to wash my hair every day because um, I read somewhere that that's not good for your hair. And also like every two or three months I'll use a coconut mask on my hair and I just use a scoop of coconut oil and I just put it from here down cut, like soaking my hair and then I'll sleep in it wrapped up overnight and I feel like that really makes your hair feel so soft and it really is a good hair mask. So that is my hair care routine so let's move on into my skincare routine. I like to use this to cleanse it at nighttime, and this is the Clean and Clear Morning Burst Cleanser. And I have been using this legit since seventh grade. And I've tried other cleansers, but every single time I try a new one, my face always hates it and I break out or I get like a rash or something on my face. So that is my tried and true favorite skin cleanser. After I wash my face at night with this, I always use this and this is my favorite thing in the whole world. This is the Josie Moran 100% Pure Argon Oil, Organic Moisturizing Oil, and I use this as my face moisturizer every single night, and it looks like this. Uh, this is my favorite part, because it comes in a little thing, and I feel like a scientist when I use it. And I use this, and I use about one, two, two drops a night. And I just rub it together and put it all over my face and my neck and I really love that moisturizer. I really feel like it heals my skin like whenever I have a breakout or a spot or something. It heals the spot really fast and it heals the scar so it doesn't scar and stay there for like an eternity. For those of you with oily skin that are probably a little bit nervous of putting an oil straight on your face. I have to say, I thought the same thing. I have like combination skin. I have like some areas of my face are dry and some are a little bit oily. And I was like, oh, I'm not gonna use an oil on my face because that's just gonna make me look really oily. But that's not true. It's actually made my skin less oily and my skin has become more just normal and like not no dry patches, no oily patches. So if you have oily skin, do not be scared of using an oil on your face. You could actually use the light version of this. They have the Josie Morgan Argon Oil in the light formula and that would just absorb into your skin a little bit faster. I highly recommend you guys get that because my skin has really never felt so healthy and um, 
I really rarely break out after I've been using this so I love that. I think that my biggest tip for you guys would be to wash your face every single night and get a good moisturizer that works for your skin and that's pretty much all. I don't really use any toners or have any crazy skincare steps or um, crazy products that I use but I think that's sometimes good because um, then it can just be overwhelming to use like a million different products at night. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that maybe you got some good recommendations or some good tips. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I post a video every Monday. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I will see you very soon. Bye!